Hello everyone. I had a bit of a break, got myself a new coffee, and I'm about to get started in golf. I'm not sure how well I'm going to be at this. Oh, I've got to put in my. Oh, while I do that, I'll. Uh, what I'll do is I'll uh, give you on a. Okay, we're back. I'm just uh, just tried to put my age. Well, I did put my age in, but you know you're getting old when it requires you to scroll back 20 pages to get the year of your birth. I'm having a cross on, so. Hello Apologies. there and welcome to the Golf Club 2019. My name's John and I'm going to try to get you going here, show you how to swing that club like a pro. Let's get into it. All right. I've chosen mouse and keyboard because, well, I'm old school. To begin your swing, push and hold the left mouse button and pull back. When a golfer reaches the top of their backswing, push the mouse forward to swing. Make sure you keep holding that mouse button throughout the swing. Was that okay? Oh, you hold it throughout and the swing. it. Let's keep moving. After each shot, you will get feedback as to how accurate your shot was in the bottom right-hand corner. In the middle of that circle, there's a blue swing plane. In order to be accurate with your shots, you're going to have to keep your swing within the lane. Let's give this another go. Have another swing and try to keep that swing within that swing plane. Was that within the plane? Great stuff out there. Let's Let's move on. Okay. You will also receive feedback on your swing tempo just underneath your swing accuracy indicator. Mm -hmm. Now, if you are too swift or too sluggish on your backswing or follow through, your shot could lose power, it could get some wonky spin, or it could go further off target. Now let's try swinging with a smooth motion to achieve the perfect tempo. I know. I know. No, I don't. Oh, that was terrible. Well, it says perfect. But Jesus. 
I'm not sure if the tempo was perfect. All right, that didn't pan out. Uh, let's try that again. All right. So, ooh, that's gone somewhere different. Wasn't in the blue square though. Nicely done. Let's move on. Oh, you gotta okay, be kidding! Okay, well, I think that's the minimum uh, amount of stuff you need to get started. If you'd like more challenge or distance from your shots, try changing your clubs in the profile menu. And be sure to test out your equipment first on the driving range. And if you're looking for more advanced shot techniques, go ahead and check out the other lessons that are available in our training menu. I'll, okay, see I'll, you next time. I'll do that. Welcome to the putting lesson. Now this is the we one. We're going to learn the ins and outs of putting here today so you can gain strokes where it matters most. You know what they say, drive for show, putt for dough, folks. Let's go. Okay, to begin your putt, hold that left mouse button and pull the mouse back. The farther you pull, well, you nailed that one. Let's, let's move on. Now, getting your putt strength just right comes down to feel at the end of the day, and each green can feel different. You can keep an eye on your putter's max distance in the top right to get an idea of what the current green speed is. This putt is just a few inches downhill, so use your aim stick to move the putting marker just in front of the hole. How's that? You nailed that one. Let's keep going. The dots on the grid are showing us that this putt is going to be breaking from right to left, so you will have to aim to the right to compensate. To make your adjustments before sinking this putt, hold the right mouse button and drag to the right or use the right arrow key on the keyboard. Oh, come on! <sighs> you said well, it was going to break. Work. Let's yeah. try that one again. You said it was going to break. It's not breaking at all, is it? You said it was going to break. Well, that didn't quite pan out. Let's uh, give that another go. Yeah, well, here's one. Well, it's not breaking at all. I know you said it's going to break. Hmm. Mm. That uh, should probably be tried again. Oh. Uh... Okay, it broke a little bit. But it broke the other way. Oh, now it's breaking. And that's just terrible. Okay. Oh, I didn't even hit it. That didn't quite pan out, I guess. Uh, we'll try again. Oh, I hit it too hard. Drag the mouse while holding the mouse to adjust your aim before porting the sink. Okay. What Great the? work out there. That was fantastic. Let's keep moving. All right, and I think now you're ready to tear things up on the green. And by tear things up, I mean be very responsible. Hello, and welcome to this lesson where we will talk about clubs and shot types. I am going to show you how to make the most of what's in your golf bag with a few simple tricks. Let's go. Okay, so for this shot, you're hitting into the wind. This means you are going to have to club up. Or, in other words, use a longer club. So let's press the change club button until you get to the pitching wedge. Then just pop this shot onto the green. Pop it onto the green. I didn't pop it onto the green. Not quite. Uh, let's reset. Try again. I popped it over the green. That one's on the green. No, no, no. Mm, not, not quite there, is it? Let's try again. Is that a bit too much? I think it might have been. Too much club? No, 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 no. Pretty good. It's on the green. Nicely done. Next. Next. Now, it's only a matter of time before you find yourself in a situation where the normal shot type is just not going to do. Now, to get on the green from here, you are going to need a chip shot. So let's press the change shot type button until you get to the chip shot and then chip that ball nice and close to the pin with your next stroke. 
too far away, baby. Yeah, not quite. Let's try that one again. Oh, I can't get it running. And let's just go ahead and try that again, okay? Yeah, okay. Oh, that was... What was that? What was that? No, not quite. Let's try that again. That was terrible. Oh, come on. Have I changed club or something? Have I, have I changed club? There you go. I'm using a gap wedge, whatever. I'm using a gap wedge, whatever the fuck that is. Because it's not big enough. I want to change club. Hmm, not quite. Let's try that again. Can't, I can't change club? See? I'm gonna practice. Hmm. <laughs> Cripes. I'm going to be lucky if the ball goes anywhere near the hole today. You know, I might switch to... Uh, I might switch to... Uh, can I do that? Sign controller. Didn't I sign the controller? I thought I did. It's not really assigning my controller. Oh, barely got in there. Very well done. Let us move on. Information about the current lie of your ball is available always in the top right corner of the screen. This will give you a range of how much spin and power your shot will retain. And then you can use that info to adjust your shot no, accordingly. I want now, to for pitch this particular that. situation, you're going to want to club up to the sand wedge and yeah. switch your shot type Clearly. to the flop shot. Then stick this one on the green. In the hole. Well done. Let's move on. Now, with these few tricks under your belt, you can really take your game up a notch out there on the course. Okay, Hello what tricks? and welcome to the lesson on advanced shots. In this lesson, we're going to learn about techniques you're going to want to master if you want to compete with the pros. Let's begin. Okay, sure. Sometimes you'll need to make a partial start <coughs> to dial in your distance just the way you need it. In this case, your chip shot's going to go about twice as far as the cup. Try cutting your power in half by adjusting your backswing height and follow through speed to land this one near the cup. See, when. when uh, didn't quite get that. Let's try that one again. When I, when I want to fub it up. Oh, look at that. Well, that was no problem. Let's keep going. 
Manually adjusting the loft of your shots is going to help you get that ball closer to your target. The catch here is that changing your loft also increases the difficulty of your shot. While holding the shot shaper key, hold the right mouse button and drag the mouse up or use up on the keyboard to increase your loft on this next shot. Land this shot near the cup. Your increased loft is going to give that shot a little backspin. It's going to keep that ball from rolling off the green. You reckon? Surely it's got to get onto the green before it can roll off the green? I think we've got time for another try at this one. Yeah, I think we've got another time. You know what? I want to go the other way. <laughs> I don't want to increase the loft. Hmm. Let's uh, just mm. go ahead and give that another try. Can I get another club? Where the hell does that go? All right, that didn't pan out. Let's give it another go. Jesus. Oh, now I was overdoing it. I was overlofting it. Nicely done, and we're moving on. Applying a fade or a draw to your shot can really open up some stroke-saving shortcuts. And you guessed it, this will also increase the difficulty of your shot. While holding down the shot shaper key, hold down the right mouse button and drag to the left, or use the left arrow key on the keyboard to add draw to your shot. Then swing away and land this one on the left-hand side of the driving range. You said fade. I thought you said fade. Uh, I don't think you got that quite. Let's, let's yeah. best to try that again. Yeah, okay. I thought I thought you said fade. As in fade ray. Ooh. Nice work out there. Let's move on. With lots of practice, these advanced techniques are going to prove to be invaluable parts of your game. And if you'd like these new... Okay, 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 okay. I would like to change... ...my controllers. I do the training again because now that I've changed the controller oh left button right button Pretty perfect. But it's not exactly what I wanted. Although you get a really big swing. Oh, there's a couple of deer. Oh, do they moo.
Wow, okay. I was thinking it was going to be left stick, right stick. Backwards, upwards. Instead... So, but it's going off to the left there. My left right, right right. At least I'm hitting it straight. But it's not exactly what I want to do with the controller, so I might have to just pop out. Go back to settings. Wing stick. You need a uh, I think you need the Microsoft one. <laughs> That's a nose, that's a nose shot. I don't know what I'm doing. It's a little bit more different than it was 
with the mouse in the olden days in the olden days got some distance but surprisingly it was accurate <laughs> in the end <laughs> oh dear this is almost realistic in my swing <laughs> my real swing <laughs> well, there's a little bit of a dwar on that little fella. The good thing is. Can't get that little one down the bottom there in the right blue zone. I think you got to get it in the blue zone. I'm not sure. What the? Okay, I'm just training myself here to so I don't look so bad when I go out there on the field because it will be bad, baby. See, for some odd reason, that remains straight, but it didn't get distance. Well, that's not so odd because. It's not so odd because you're very bad at this. Very, very bad. Ooh, where's that gone? That's gone in the next fairway, that is. Oh, but see, down here, I almost got it into the blue. Get into the blue, boy, you gotta blue your. Uh, there's another one of my favourite shots called the Fluck Up, where you fluck it up. Yes, 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 keep going. I could see it from four different camera angles. Woo! Woo! Perfect! <laughs> You're joking me. You're joking me, aren't you, Sunshine? Alright, so that's, that's a reasonably perfect shot. Just got to get used to it. It's a different swing than I'm used to from the... Oh, that's a bit too... 80% of power. Not enough backswing. Oh, here we go. But 90% power. 
Hundred percent power. Oh, okay. So just a little bit more backswing than I've been doing it. <laughs> oh, sorry, Ma malignity. I, I, I thought I'd, I'd changed it to the golf club. I apologies, man. But yes, I'm, I'm in the golf club. And mind you, D&D is probably similar, it's hack and slash, and that's what my golf game is like. Oh, Christ. Someone, someone put me out of my misery. <laughs> you know, I, I use Restreamer, so it should have gone through and carried it through. But let me just check that, because... Good old Restreamer sometimes just doesn't do what I want it to do. No, it, it's got it as updated as the golf club. Oh, but the game is still Dungeons & Dragons. Damn! Damn! Alright, so I've got to actually change the game. Oh, I'm an idiot. <laughs> Where am I? Where's my stream? Where's my stream? Oh, I've got to log in first. Uh, Twitch, please. Sancho. Yeah, it still says Dungeons and Dragons. That's because I didn't change the damn name of the game. Boofus. I'm a Boofus. Alright, let's go to my channel. Uh, and let's... Uh, I didn't change the damn name of the game. Oh. Boofus. I'm a Boofus. Okay, uh, alright. Turn the sound off first. Alright. So let's change that to... How do I change the name of the game? Go back. Go back. Uh, uh, uh. Mm. How do I change the name of the game? Go come, come. Yo, yo, yo. Oh, is it in my main? Go back. Video. Mm. Just make sure that the sound isn't coming through. Oh, this is going to be a little. Oh, edit panels, of course. Start editing. No, that's not going to do nothing. That ain't gonna do nothing. Uh, da, 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 da. Oh, I've got to go back to the start of the stream. Poo. Oh, yeah, there is a lot of slicing. Uh, okay. I'll bugger it. Where are we? I, 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 I should have done it properly. Let me see if I can do it from my good friend. Yeah, I can. I'll do it from the streamer. Change it up here. Uh, 
weird. So I can change it down in the name description. Alright, so hopefully that's passed it on. Eventually. <laughs> Probably not. Uh, so if I go to my channel again. Yay, it's changed it. Alright. Hooray for me, I figured it out. Okay, so now it says the Golf Club 2019, which is what it is. And I am struggling. Now that's a perfect shot. Uh, and he hit the golf cart. Should have gone for more. I think I'm getting used to it. Now the wind is the only factor that I've got to worry about. Well, two shots doesn't make you an expert. Two shots just make it expert. Okay, so there's a little bit of wind. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> uh, at least it's uh, in the middle of the fairway. Cripes almighty. I think it's I'm going too far back with the mouse and too far forward at the same time. I'm a higgly jiggly. At least that's my excuse and I'm just sticking with it. At least the backstroke was good. Or the forward stroke, whatever it is. Stroke stroke. You know what it is. Swing and away. I think I'll just start my first game because that way I can really screw it up. I'm only managing to get 90% power. It's annoying. It's given me this perfect rubbish, but it's not really perfect, is it? It's not perfect when you're 90%. Oh, okay. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. Let's just test that out again. With one more show. Wing! And see what happens. Well, it's 95, but... So I'm trying to try to cheat with finding some kind of rest of arm. No. Don't know what this means. a duty and a fan doogly all right I'm ready to make a fool of myself on the course okay what do you say uh, let's go out uh, quit that one Okay, societies. Ooh, society. I don't know what a society is. Let's change what I look like. No, nationality is not that. It's Australian, mate. Ooh. 
I guess it's probably that one. Only they don't have a f make fatter button. Skin tone is probably a little wider. My height is actually... I don't know what my height is. It's in inches. Uh, I'm six foot two. So... Six twelves... Seventy-two? Is that it? I'm really bad with maths right now. No, 74. And I'm uh, way nowhere near that. I'm uh, more about here. Yeah, secondary colour is probably white. <laughs> uh, Alright. Beginner clubs, that's uh, about right. Okay, let's... Uh, let's take the tour. Q school. Finish the season top 50 points. All right. Let's see if I can just finish a game. Let's go. Let's go with medium. the game. There you go. A handicap. Mm. I think the handicap is me. TPC Scott Stale for this Q School final alongside John McCarthy. John, an absolute pleasure to be here. Thanks very much, Luke. It's so nice to be able to have you part of uh, the Golf Club 2019, and especially glad to be here at TBC Scottsdale. I've never been here before, obviously. So oh my god! See a course like this, and it looks like it's, it's prime for uh, for quite an event here today. Uh, have you been down to the course? I mean, have you been looking around at this place? Because I'm in awe. Yeah, beautiful patch of land, this one. A really good testing golf course. But the superintendents, you've got to take your hat off to them. They've done an outstanding job. If a player makes a mistake, it'll be on them. Absolutely. It's going to be very, very interesting to see what happens. And I'm just, just soaking it all in down here in Scottsdale and uh, hoping for an exciting round of golf. You know, there's no golf like the Q School. Uh, this is where pressure really elevates. Imagine playing for your future. Well, that's what this week's all about. Can't wait to check it out. We're going to check back in with you after nine holes and, uh, and we'll see how things are going after that. Woohoo! 
<laughs> okay. First shot. Here we go. Wish me luck. And there we go. Got those first drive nerves out of the system. Should be interesting. This audience. Yay! Yeah, he's probably gonna like that. I, I am gonna like that. All right, so I am how many yards away? Sixty-six. It's two feet up. I might go. Well, change it to a normal shot for starters. No, actually, go back to the pitch. But get up a club. Oh! oh. Gun. I didn't like that. <laughs> How do you like them apples? I, 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 I would have been happy if it was in the green. Now, this is the part that I, I, I can't get right. This is why most of my parts. And yeah, finishing the hole with a solid putt. And starting today's round off at one under par. There you go. Not bad after one hole. And team off on this par four. It's a longie. Wind's pretty good. You give me the driver, which is great. Okay, so it's just a matter of stick shift it. Oh, I might have bounced it a bit too much, but that's okay. Because, see, I meant to do that. I meant to get it on that little crescent. Yeah, so that probably it, like that. So to bounce back in the middle of the... I should practice. Going with a pitching wedge here. I thought he was going to say, going to another planet. And it was going to another planet. Cause it nice shot, I think I like that. No. And about 14 feet to the cup. I didn't like it. It's a little bit, little bit on the hole. Okay, here we go. Oh, oh just, just inches away. See, see what happens okay. when I hit it too what much. When I hit it too much, that's what happens. And now it's going to be nowhere near Ooh. it. This putt is for the bogey. And a nice putt. It's a terrible putt. And after that hole, he will go up to even putt. And now let's move to the third hole. Par five. Seventeen on the stroke index, whatever that means. <laughs> I mean, I've played the occasional game of golf, but not not with any success. Oh, 
Oh. Okay, that's that's interesting. See, I I thought. Oh my god! 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 Man, he's probably. I not think too I'm in like trouble. I think I'm definitely in trouble. Stop right. clapping. This life will be better than the last. You're making me nervous. Stop clapping. Uh Let's go down a club, shall we? What the fuck was that? What do I use? Yeah, about a hundred and ten yards to the pin from here. What club did I use? And uh, sensing something was off on that swing. Yeah, me. Oh no! Oh no! And that is not oh. for the dance floor. <laughs> Just not enough club on that one. Uh. Oh no! You're joking me! Come on, take it easy. to go here. Oh, it's not that much of a swing either. Finishing this hole with a solid putt. And our leader today sitting up on uh, top of the board here at two under par. I'm not the leader. How can I be? Oh, I'm two over. Mmm. Mm. Uh, Alright, so this is uh, straight up, straight up in your face, 141 yards, 7 feet up, so I might go up a little bit. And try to practice uh, Eight irony. That was awful. Well, not the best approach shot we've seen today. That was awful. In the hole. Ah! Oh! <laughs> and this putt to save par. Yeah, I need to save par and ma. Butt drops. And currently sitting at two over for the day. Okay, and here is the fifth hole. <sighs> okay, show me what you got. Dude, dude, where's my drive? Right there. All right. Wind's a little bit picky. Let's 
This one's looking pretty good so far. From 130 yards. And going with the nine iron. Nine iron? Yeah, this might be a bit too much club. I hope not. Well, turns out that one is safely on the green. 21 feet to the cup from here. With a little swing to the left. Oh, too much, too much, too much, too much, too much. Too much, too much, too much, too much. Just race down. Oh, Christ. From 20 feet. Oh, Christ. I get to do 20 feet again. Well, that's fantastic. I get two shots at a long part. And this one's going to be short. Oh, that hurt me. And this putt is for bogey. That hurt me so much. And currently sitting at plus three for the day after that hole. Currently sitting at the bottom. What did you say at the bottom? And now setting up for the next par four hole. So it's par four. All right. So I won't have to use a driver. Oh no, he's going to give me the driver anyway. But I don't know why you'd give me a driver. I'm all right with the three wood. I'm pretty sure I'm all right with the three wood. That was low. Nicely done. Looking like. We'll have some fairway here. No, <laughs> that was crap. Okay, about 165 yards to the pin. Mm, 165 yards to the pin. Okay, metric, please. Help a poor yeah, Aussie like out. Six iron. This one's looking good. In the, hole, in the hole. 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 Come on, I really wanted a hole in two. And this putt's for birdie. Oh, Jesus. Down two feet. Just missing here. And this for the par. Close. Just didn't go. This puts about three feet away. And this puts gonna drop the bogey. Well, I doesn't look like I'm gonna be passing yeah, any Q school. He's gonna move down in the standings after that one. Man, let's see what the seventh hole has in store. I, sh I should have gone with easy. <laughs> Three. It's uh, five feet up. The wind's a bit off to one side. I've got a hybrid, half a pack of cigarettes, and I'm wearing sunglasses. Looks like the uh, hybrid is on display here. And I think he will be happy with that. No. <laughs> then tell me what I will be and what I won't be because that was not happiness. Looking like eight feet to the cup here. Yeah. Eight feet, and might as well be 
21 feet. Ooh, and it just misses. And this putt is for bogey. Another bogey. I'm doing everyone a favor by collecting a whole series of bogeys. Look at the leaderboard. Our current leader today is sitting at 53. Christ. How am I going to pick up six holes? How am I going to pick up six strokes the way I'm playing? The only thing I'm going to pick up is a stroke. Oh. They say that you'll never make it. And then you play like shit. And they know that they were telling you the truth of it. I need to practice this. Oh, too bad. Fast. How could that be perfect? That was too fast. I don't understand this game at times. Oh. Oh. Get back on the fairway, baby. I don't know why I did that. Other than... I'm pretty shitty with any club, so... And this putt is essential to save par. Nice little putt. I'm currently sitting at five over for the day after that hole. This is terrible. And on to the ninth hole. The American's going to come back and laugh at me. Because he said he's going to come back after nine holes. And he'll just laugh at me. He'll just say, who the hell is this idiot? I mean, it's nothing new. But, you know, getting abused by an American. What a promising looking shot here. And about 175 yards to the pin. I think that's a five iron. I think that's in trouble. Because I forgot to add a pin for height. And ladies and gentlemen, that was a, that was a poor approach. Yeah, really? You, you figured that out all on your own? Doofus. Five feet to go here. Yeah, five feet, might as well be 228 feet. Ooh, and uh, just doesn't want to try. And this one's for the bogey. This game is going to give me nightmares. Now let's take a look at the leaderboard. All right, Luke, what are you seeing out there today as you make your rounds? Curious as to your point of view as we uh, cross the nine-hole threshold in this final round of action. Well, John, they probably won't be making that next step in their career playing like this. 
but if they can make up a few strokes on the back nine, there may be a chance they'll make the web.com tour. Thanks for that, Luke. Fuck off, Luke. Fuck off. So, it wasn't the American that's embarrassing me, it's the Australian. So, fuck off. Fuck off, Aussie. Fuck off, Aussie, fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off, Aussie, fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off, Aussie, fuck off. Why am I... Oh, because I punched it. I don't want to punch it. I want to hit it normal. Now I know what I was making wrong. Normal, that's what I want. Normal. Not that I'm going to hit it normal. Yeah, everyone's already gathered around to see the idiot. Yeah, I think you'll like that. And a buck ninety out here. Buck ninety. Pretty sure that's the five wood. Uh, heads. That didn't uh, sound like the cleanest of contact. Heads. And yeah, nothing to write home about on that approach shot. This one's about six feet away. And that par putt will drop. And as we look at the leaderboard, our uh, current leader sits at one under. I want to go again. The 11th hole. Do I have to wait a year? <laughs> Do I have to wait a year to try for the school again? Cause that just sucks. And nothing wrong with that shot. And about 170 yards to the pin. Short again. Because I hit it slows. Well, that was an unfortunate approach. And this one's about four feet from the cup. And that one drops for part. And he's going to move up in the standings after that hole. Oh, I got to move up. Oh, that's good. And teeing off on this par three. I got moving up. I like moving up. Moving on up, you're moving on down. You're moving on left and you're moving on round. Move it, move it. Check it out now. But hole so far, whatever the name of the song is. 157, 157, three feet. Looks like a seven iron. Wow, I landed on the green in regulation. And this putt's for birdie. Yeah, <laughs> dream on with that. Dream on with that, sunshine. And this is right around the eight foot mark. Yeah, eight foot mark. Ooh, that was very close. 
just didn't didn't drop. You know, the definition of very close is missed. And that will be for bogey. The definition of very right, close in golf is you fucked up. That's what the definition is. Alright, let's see what uh, happens on this <coughs> here. Water! Mmm! Looking good. Looking good, water. Always good to see some water out there. Ah, oh, it's not that bad. Okay, this one's looking pretty good. From 240 yards out. 240 yards out. You think? You think I can get there? Because I don't think you've been watching my game. Here's the three wood. Luckily, it's part five. And I could do stuff like this. Still a mile and a half away. And nothing wrong with that shot. And from 24 feet away. It says it's above six inches or six inches above the hole. Get in! Right into the cup. Very, very nicely done. And he's going to move up the moving board after that one. <laughs> and now teeing off on this par four. Par four? Par for four? As the English would say, or the French would say? God knows what the French would say. They're French. He appears to be heading for the fairway here. Who knows what the French would say? Being French and everything. 180 yards out. And eight foot up. If I go up a club. And because I do crappy, crappy slow things, I think this things, shot might uh, might have a bit too much club. I rather have a bit too much than not enough. And I should have. That's uh, safely on the green. I should have flopped it. And this is for birdie. Good luck with that. That's downhill. That's an eight inch downhill run. It's running. It's running, baby. It's gonna go run, 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 And as we look at the leaderboard, our leader is currently at one under par. Par doesn't do you anything, man. And yeah, moving on to the 15th hole. Par doesn't get you nothing. What you need is what you need. And that is straight up. No, no, no. 
No. No, you don't need that. I can't see him being too happy about that one. You and you're right. You're absolutely right. I will, I'm not too happy about that one. All right. So basically, I've got a longer approach shot than they would normally have had. Is back in the fairway with the green in reach. Let's see what happens. Okay, and from 125 yards out. Going with the nine iron here. This one's looking a bit long, folks. I think he's going to like that. Setting up for a 38 foot putt. Suddenly, suddenly, I, I hit a shot of right size. Not enough. And from that length, that is just, just fine work. What and the fuck? That one currently sitting at five over. How the fuck did I do that? I was nowhere near the hole. And setting up on the 16th tee. I'll take it, but you know, let me know when you give me stuff. No. And this putt is for Birdie. Well, that just swung. That's for par. Swinged. And a good putt. I would have liked the birdie. And no change uh, ranking wise after that hole. And now setting up for the par four tee off. Eagle, please. Why don't you eagle me, buttercup, whatever your thingy, my Bobby? Good thing I aimed to the other side. And I am pretty sure he's going to like that. Again with the I'm going to like shit. Like how am I going to like that? Why would I even like that? See that's the one time I... Okay from 30 feet out. This is about a four footer. And that one drops for par. And in today's event, the score to beat is one under currently. And 
ladies and gentlemen, he's finally here. The final hole. And he's six strokes off the lead. Let's see what happens. <laughs> I got eight strokes off the lead. <laughs> Jesus. And this shot's looking promising. Yeah, promising. Promising to go onto the rough. But, in actual fact, it ended up in the rough. Promising. Gotta be pleased with that. And this next putt for a final round score of 75. Oh my goodness, close, very close, but once again. And for the par. And that one will drop. Well, that just gave Luke me. Is over. Uh, he has finished the event, and he will qualify for the Web.com Tour. I really like the look of this player, John. I think they've got a bright future. I really feel the Web.com Tour is just a stepping stone to a big career. How could you so qualify at that? Here. I'm Luke Elvey, and from John McCarthy, see you next time. How can I qualify with that terrible round? <laughs> Too much, too much, too much rubbish. All right, that was a little bit of fun. I'm going to go call it a day while I go home from lunch. I do enjoy playing a bit of golf. Uh, I, I remember playing PGA golf way back in the 1990s with a friend of mine who has since no longer with us uh, and so that's brought a bit of uh, a bit of memory so um, I enjoyed that it's worth a purchase for me anyway uh, it is a bit hard on my uh, non-Microsoft joystick in the sense that it doesn't go off the right joystick at all, it goes off the D controller. Don't know why. It's crazy. Um, but everything good in the end. Uh, oh, I know why. I know why. I'm an idiot. I'll fix that up and I'll come back. All right. So um, enjoy your luncheon. I'll enjoy mine. Thanks for your time, and we will be playing some more golf after lunch. Bye-bye.